And I feel like I have to, I feel like I can, I feel like I can do this. And um, I'm gonna try. I don't really know how to start this video, but I guess I'll just say I deleted my YouTube channel. I deleted my channel because over the past, not months, but like the past year, I'm really, I'm not the same person that I was when I started my YouTube channel. I've really changed a lot. I just realized now that I need to be making my videos different. I just feel so much more at peace, so much more connected with Jesus. I was in adoration again, and I said a prayer as I asked the Blessed Mother to bring my prayer to her son, and I just wanted to know what his will was, because that's really all I want to do is just do what he wants me to do. If I was in control of my life, I don't know where I'd be right now. 10,000. Um, that's crazy. It's actually crazy. You know, I was hoping for this day that it might come. Um, but now that it is here, or it was a few days ago, um, it's, it's, it's kind of surreal. Like, I, it, I don't even really believe it. You know, a lot. One thing that people um, don't really talk about is that you know that number ten thousand is ten thousand people who chose to subscribe. So that ten thousand is you guys. You are all individually part of that ten thousand number. You know, without you guys, there would be no, there would there wouldn't be the channel. The channel would not exist. It wouldn't exist. Um, but there is one who also deserves much, much, much credit for, um, this channel. I'm being as real as I possibly can be. Um, Our Lady, the Queen of Heaven, Mary, Mother of God, without her. This would never have happened, ever. Without her rosary, this would never have happened. I'll give you a quick story. I've said it in previous videos before, but a lot of people have not watched those, so I'll say it real quick. I had a channel before this. I was only able to get it to around, like slightly over 300 subscribers. And then, um, I actually got one of those things where you can buy bots. So I got a thousand bots. So I had like a thousand three hundred some, um, uh, and that was just so stupid. Ba that channel, um, was very, um, different from this one. Very different. Uh, it was still video games, but they were not the same kind of video games. They were all... Almost all of them were really, um, really bad. Uh, very morally questionable. Uh, particularly in regard to violence. And, uh, you know, I would play a lot of violent games. I'd also play a lot of, uh, horror games, which, you know, they, they're, they're kind of hit or miss, right? But a lot, of, I know some of them were, were very, uh, demonic. And some even sacrilegious. And um, I regret it to this day uh, that I I just didn't know. I was I didn't know what I was doing. And one thing that's very interesting is that I had that channel to my best of my memory. I had it, I think, longer than I've had this channel. I graduated in 2020, so I had that old channel from middle school middle school which is like eighth seventh or eighth grade maybe even before that i don't remember but somewhere around there all the way up till um 
early 2020, I'm pretty sure. Which is what, like almost six years I had that old channel and I could only get it up to 300 some subscribers. But this channel I've only had for three years and it's at 10,000. In my conversion, because I was Protestant, raised Protestant, converted to Catholicism, but I was baptized Catholic. I was in adoration. It was kind of near the beginning of our conversion. And uh, I, it was so crisp clear. Our Lord said, you know what? You should delete your YouTube channel entirely. Don't save any videos. Delete it completely. Completely. Don't s save a single one of those videos. You know, and I thought about it. I was like, you know what? Okay. I deleted it completely. I didn't save a single video. None of them. None of them. Um, there were so even. I guess there was some. I I could. I thought about. Oh, I could save this one because it's not that bad. But I just deleted them all. You can't find them anywhere, except for my very first video, which is. I reacted to that when I hit 300 subscribers. I the card is somewhere. And a uh, few months later, continual going to adoration, praying the rosary. I think I was, I'm I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure I was praying the rosary in adoration. And our lady said, like, it was like a whisper. It was like, remake your YouTube channel, but promote my rosary. Initially, I was like, I just, I didn't, I deleted my old one, like, not very long ago. And now... You want me to make a, a new one? I mean, okay, so I, so again, I was like, okay, whatever. So I made a coming back video explaining a little bit, and then I made one video game. I think it was like getting over it. And then I made my first rosary video. It was the Sorrowful, the Sorrowful Mysteries. Incorporating the rosary into this entire channel is is and just the Catholic faith in general is, I think, it just goes to show, it, it's, it's really taught me something, you know? Um, you don't have to sacrifice morality and stuff and sacrifice your soul to, I don't know, I mean, you should, your, your goal in life should not be to gain the world or to gain respect from other people um, no matter what the trends are, or no matter what people are doing, well, all these people are doing this, so I'm going to do it too, to fit into the world, right? That's not what your goal should be. It should be to please God and God alone. Now, I, I say all this, and I am not perfect at it at all. I am not perfect at living the Catholic life or the Christian life in general. Um, I'm just saying it because I know it's true. I'm not saying it because I'm, I'm. I think I'm better than anybody. I'm, I'm literally not better than a lot of people. I'm not the best person out there. Um, but uh, I know it's true. I know that that is what we all should strive to do. I, I'm telling you guys. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Use th that as an example. This my little story about the two YouTube channels I made. I mean, I I promise. I I promise. I would. I I like. It is so in my soul. It's so. Tr I know it's true. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. The rosary is the key to life. It will fix all of your problems. I'm not joking. The power behind this prayer, we can't even fathom. And it still shocks me to this day. Some, you know, some of the things that have happened to, like, if I look back at my life and some of the things that have happened because, you know, we decided to pray the rosary. It's it's just still shocks me, um, that I d and and, and it, I'm just thankful that I I'm just thankful for Our Lady. It very well may be the case that 
what God wants you to do is not what you want to do. But that's okay. Because He knows you better than you know yourself. And He knows what will make you happy. Even if you think you know what will make you happy. He knows better. He does know better. Especially in today's world, there's so much crazy stuff going on. It's just, it's just folk, um, smoke and fog everywhere. You don't know what's true and what's not true. You don't know who to listen to. You know, there's always two sides to every single thing. It's, it's just, it's crazy, especially for most of my viewers. I'm sure you're probably adolescent teenagers or, you know, some, I'm sure there are some are older, some are younger. Um, but, you know, for teenagers, my heart just goes out to you because it's tough. It's tough being a teenager um, because, you know, I'm sure some of you, um, it's such a weird place to be. You're not a kid, but you're not an adult yet. So you feel it's so weird. It's just weird being a teenager because you don't really know where you are yet you know but that's you know that's okay you know and, and i'm i'm still young enough to remember like yeah it feels like sometimes you just feel like you know no one understands you like your parents don't understand you your siblings don't understand you people at school don't understand you like no one can understand how you feel and i in and i get that you know, I don't, I don't know exactly how you feel, but I understand that feeling of like just weird confusion. Um, but I promise you, even though it's a, it's a longer prayer, it takes time. Pray the rosary, please pray the rosary. It'll, it'll, it'll just bring that peace about your life. Um, I know I know a lot of people frown upon it, you know, and but um, it is tr it is it is it has changed my life and it will change your lives as well. The, this channel would not exist without the rosary. Oh, it's just I still can't believe it. I can't believe it. 10,000 subscribers is absolutely huge. I kind of wanted to do some sort of like you know, celebration video more so than, you know, kind of a serious video, but I really thought this was necessary. Man, it's just, it's still, it's still, it's just crazy. 10,000 subscribers. I don't know 10,000 people. I don't even know a thousand people, okay? So I, I thought a thousand was a lot. And 10,000? 10,000? That's like a small town or something. So guys, I think I'm gonna end it there. Um, thank you guys so much. Remember, you guys, every single one of you is part of that 10,000. It's not something that I achieved. It's something that you guys made happen. So thank you guys so much. And hopefully, hopefully we can continue to make videos and to have fun and play more Mario games. But yeah, at the end of the day, it all points back to the rosary. Pray the rosary every single day. And if you can't pray it every day, pray it as often as you can. It will change your life. It will change your life. I promise, I promise, I promise. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to drop me one of these. Subscribe if you haven't already. I'll see you next video until then. Pray the rosary, use the sacraments, go to reconciliation, repent of your sins,